friends. Welcome back to my channel. I'm going to be setting up my new wallet today. I got a cash envelope wallet that I'm going to be carrying with me and I'm going to set it up today and um, put labels on each of the envelopes and then stuff a little bit of money here in for that. So if you're interested in videos like these, please subscribe and um, follow along. So I got this new wallet from Amazon. It's an A7 size. And I wanted something that I could carry around and keep my cash in, but also keep the cash separated from each other. I had this before. Um, this is a wallet I got from Target and I love the color and love it, but um, it doesn't hold very much. And I also, like I said, I wanted to keep the, the cash separate from each other. So I'm gonna be transferring over what was in this over here into different categories once I set them up. And this will be the wallet that I take with me grocery shopping and um, running other errands so that I can use the cash first. And then whatever is left over, I'll start doing some savings challenges, I hope. I am um, looking forward to that. So um, let's get started. So. Like I said, this is an F7 wallet. Um, it comes with three card holders, a little pocket right here. I'll move these out. And another little pocket right here. Um, then it also comes with stickers so you can make your own um, labels for your envelopes, but I don't really love these stickers. They look old to me <laughs> and I can't keep my handwriting similar enough for them to look good so I'm not going to be using these they also come with um, little budget sheets that will fit into here and I believe they'll even fit no maybe not I don't think that they'll fit in the envelopes themselves but they'll fit on the binder and then it came with let me see how many I can't remember one two three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So eight envelopes and these are the zipper ones. Um, I thought for a wallet, the zipper ones would be good because then I can keep change in one of them and um, I don't want anything falling out if I'm moving the wallet around. But um, as for my bigger binders, I would love, see this one is um, my F6. I would love to have envelopes that open from the side that don't have a zipper because they just get really bulky. So I have, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven categories that I wanna put on here that will be um, useful in my wallet. And so I'm gonna move some of this stuff over and I'm gonna bring out my labeler. <clears throat> So this is the Brother P-Touch labeler. Um, I also got this from Amazon and I can link it below. I don't know if you'll be able to see this screen very well. Um, yeah, a little bit. So I'm gonna be creating labels here and printing them off. And this label maker has been awesome. We use it for other home organization stuff as well. Um, but it has been perfect for my envelopes until I decide on what kind of um, scrolly font cutesy thing I want to put on here. But for right now, these are perfect. So the first thing I need to have in my wallet is, um, let's just spending. Okay, so I typed it in. And then click print and print one more time. Now the last um, font that I used was one that I really liked. So it's still set on that font and it comes in like this. I can go to font right here. And then the one that I've chosen is 10 ADM. Adam, 10 ADM. Okay, there we go. Yep, okay, worked. So now, 
put spending on this one. Perfect. All right, the next one, so I'll backspace all of this, is, let's see, the next one I wanna put in is groceries. And then print, and print. Awesome. So eventually I would like to, um, I'm actually going to put the spending one underneath. So they line up, Let's see if this works. It'll be pretty close. So eventually I'd like to get some cute I don't even know what it's called. I wanna say laminate, but that is not it. Some cute scrolly writing for the outside of these, but for right now, these are perfect. I'll set you to the side. All right, next one is dining out first. back up again <clears throat> I think these labels are so handy we've used them um, for many things but we have a like a toy closet and we put all of our um, all of our board games and things like that in there and we put them in cases and so we've been using these for those and I love it it was such a fun way to organize our board games because we had tons of them and not a lot of space and so one of these days I'll do a video on that um, so you guys can see how I organize it I got the idea off of Pinterest but it came through like it worked really well so, um, I am super happy about that. All right, so the next one is date night. And so this is um, like unexpected stuff that come up with the kids um, so that we have a little bit of money on hand right there. Um, but a lot of their other like school stuff and things like that will be in the account. We um, at our school at the end of the year at the elementary school, <clears throat> the kids can, you can buy an entire box of school supplies and then you don't have to go hunting for everything when the school year comes around. And so we're gonna be doing that this year and I am excited for it because last year I created lists and went on all the different websites, Amazon, Walmart, Target, everything to find the exact things that they needed. 
and it was expensive and super time consuming. And so I'm excited that at least one, maybe two of our kids will be able to have this option. So that will be super helpful. Okay, so I just kids, um, gifts, oops. Print, print. see how lopsided this is now that I'm trying to <laughs> put it on another one. So they're all going to be lopsided. Maybe I'll move this one just a little bit. Perfect. And then we have Nakia. Nakia is our beautiful cat. She is an African savanna cat. Um, which means she's gonna get pretty big. She's an F2, so um, the servals and the F1s get a lot bigger, quite a bit bigger, but we, um, F2 is a little bit more down the line. And so she will end up being about the size of a medium-sized dog, we assume. She is um, about a year and a half old now, and she'll keep growing for another year and a half. So it's been really fun. She is sweet and sassy all at the same time, and we just love her. Okay, and then this last envelope, I was going to put coins. And I love that this is a zipper pouch for that reason. So in the back of my wallet, I'll have a spot for coins and then I can empty them out when I um, cash stuff and things like that. So that they're not, I don't want coins in each of the envelopes because then it's kind of hard to grab anything if I need it. Um, so I just want all the coins in one place. And there is that. So we are done with the label maker. And let's put these in. So we did spending first and then groceries. The reason why they're in this specific category is because I wanted the zippers to alternate. Um, because if they're all on one side, then it just gets really bulky. But this way, um, it can be back and forth and they'll fit just a little bit better. Perfect. So it's groceries and then dining out. Like those. And then we have is it date night. So my husband and I have tried to be super frugal this year, um, but dining out is one of our big things. It also is super helpful um, when we have busy schedules. Um, the next was kids. Um, and so we've gotten pretty good at using um, like fast food places, their apps. Um, like. Chick-fil-A is wonderful and a little more expensive than some of the others, but they give out rewards a lot. Um, and so that is awesome because we love, we love all their stuff, especially have you tried their brownies? Their brownies are amazing. Fun fact, we, <laughs> we went to Chick-fil-A right after, um, we got married. Um, and so we, they had just rolled out their brownies and they're like, oh, you want one? And so they gave us one for free because we are, of course, in our car. So I was just married and I believe I was still in my dress. 
<laughs> I don't know. Anyway, we're so, yeah. Chick-fil-A is the best. Um, and we loved their brownies. We fell in love with it. And um, so, yeah, their brownies are one of our favorites now. And I, of course, love their mac and cheese. <laughs> so good. I'm talking about it now. I'm getting hungry. Um, anyway, what I was getting at was that with some of the apps, you get some stuff for cheap. Like Wendy's. Wendy's has a lot to, um, a lot to offer. Like they have a lot of good things. But then on top of it, they have like their, they used to have the four for four where you get four things for $4 and that like <laughs> helped feed our family. And then, um, now they have the $5 biggie bag and they give out, um, like coupons all the time and deals and stuff. And so we've been able to get meals for less than like two dollars sometimes and it's awesome okay enough about that anyway so here are the categories we have spending groceries move this over dining out date night kids gifts nikia and coins so um let's pull moving this over a little bit let's pull the money out so Right now we have 10, 15, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. And this was just what was left in my wallet. And so I wanted to give it um, a job. And our, um, our paydays, we, we both own our own businesses. And so our paydays are a little more sporadic um, than normal. And that's totally fine. We're trying to get more on a schedule. And so doing cash stuffings like this has been hard to be on a schedule because we don't know exactly when we get paid and how much that will be. And so um, we're doing little cash stuffings for the time being until we can get more into the groove of things. So, um, the important one today was to make sure that I have a little extra in groceries. Um, so I'm going to put 10 in there. Um, we went grocery shopping yesterday, but I need to run back by the store. And so this is helpful for that. I think it's under $10 anyway. It shouldn't be bad. And then... Um, we're going to split some of this up. Nikia already has food. And gifts needs a little bit. Yeah. We're going to put, we're going to put this $9 in gifts. My uh, friend and I are going by the store today to grab um, some flowers for another friend of ours. So that will help out with that. And then we have, oh, spending. Spending, the $5 will go in spending. And so this is great because now my money is kind of separated into what I need right away. Um, and I'm excited to kind of fill this up and get into a routine of unstuffing it and all of that. So thank you so much for following along. Um, your darling, please subscribe if you are interested in seeing more of these videos. Um, I started this YouTube channel so that I could um, kind of document my journey of becoming my best self through um, financial wellness and new hobbies and um, frugal abundance. So I'm really excited to share these things with you. So hope you have an awesome day.